Good morning guys, welcome to today. Today is a big day, a big huge day for us because we're packing, we're packing. We are packing to move to our farm, which is gonna happen really soon. We are getting, we are purging. We are getting rid of so many things, like so many things. We're moving right after Christmas, like right after Christmas. If you guys wanna be entered into the draw to win a shout out for um, tomorrow's video, then I want you guys to comment below a question that you'd like to know all about our move and all about our horses during the move and all about our pet, any question you guys have about us moving move. to a farm. Okay, let's open our other calendars. I open our advent calendars. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Anyways, yeah, we want to know. We want to do a big, huge farm question and answer video. So comment below for a chance to be in our shout out. Oh, Basically, I'm gonna show you guys what we have done so far. Um, we have we a lot of stuff. That purple bag that I filmed. Yeah, we on. sold a lot of stuff already, which is so cool. Like, who knew you could just make money? Um, these are chairs that Sam has somebody coming to pick up upstairs. Don't mind the mess, you guys. Upstairs. I have Sophie's room pretty much cleaned. Um, she's getting a bed. We actually got her a bed. We're, it'll be at the new house. You'll see it when um, we move. She doesn't like to have a bed frame. She likes her bed on the floor. One of my boys was like that. Gabby, I don't know. I don't get that. She's getting a bed frame for the new house, though. So. Um, also, everything's pretty much cleaned off. This shelf is going in the garbage. I need to tell Dad to take it. Um, that shelf is really old. Is yeah, this is old. And this stuff is going, not the wrapping paper, but um, this stuff where I'm keeping, I'm keeping her babies. I don't know why. I'm crazy like that. They're worth money. This stuff is actually going to the new house. She's all packed up. Her dresser's all clean. Um, anybody who wants a little horse? <laughs> where's, horse. where's Sophie's horse like mean. this? I don't know, but her bridle's broken. So we're finding home for some of these things. Over here in Gabby's room, she's cleaning off her shelf. Totally forgot my phone and headphones, Mom. Forgot your phone and headphones. Well, you gotta take those. I tried um, my phone up here. Sam ordered a bunch of buckets like this and we are packing them. In the new house, the girls will have one bed, one dresser, one night table, and that's it. Oh, and a chair. Right? And a closet. Yeah, and a closet. Yeah, so we're hoping to fit we everything that they're going to take with them we can sell this in one, one tub. Well, we could sell this necklace for like 300 or 200 oh, So pretty. Yeah, I don't think that one's expensive. There are some that like are expensive. 350 though, because we checked. Oh, this one she got in a candle and it was apparently in a bath bomb, a bath bomb and apparently it's worth 350 Um, But she does have some expensive ones in here. Is this yeah, the expensive, more expensive pile? She's got no, some horse nice stuff. More ex Oh, Levi. Oh. <laughs> Levi's like, woo hoo, -hoo, -hoo. Hypnotize our bird. Hypnotizing Levi. Um, in her closet, we got her closet mostly all cleaned out. Everything in here we're taking. Um, she. Oh yeah, these are your like costume jewelry on the inside. So these things will all come. We made this out of a Levi loves out of bracelet. a branch. And I Levi still really loves like bracelet. it. I love it. Do you love that we made that? You know what Levi loves? What? Do you think you love that? But see, this is costume jewelry, but it was belonged to an old woman before, an older woman, and I love it. Like, I just think it's worth something because it's so old. It's beautiful. Okay, look. He eats pearl. Um, He's afraid. He's oh, afraid. oh. Don't scare my boy. All right, we are headed up into the spooky attic. Whoa, Ruby's coming too. Ah, I've got a big, baby. your baby. You left your baby up here all this time. Whatever. Poor sweet frozen baby. At least she has, whoops, put the carrot light in there. At least she has a pacifier and a blanket. What do I want to start with, Sophie says. So this is our attic. This is what attics are for, right? Look at all peacock? those boxes. How about peacock? You can go to the second hand store. Mom, he's broken them. Oh, he can go in the garbage. He will be a good friend to Levi. He would be a good friend he, to Levi. Anyway, there are a lot of boxes up here and a lot of stuff to go through, so let's do it, Sophie. You ready? And who keeps all the empty boxes so that you can store your kids' toys back in them one day? That never, ever happens. We do. We do. <laughs> See these three horses? You guys might not know, but Sam bought another one just because it was the brown and white one, and we love that one. Um, 
There's no room for these at our new farm. Hello. But I really want to keep that one. Like, she's so beautiful. Isn't she adorable? But she's still got her ears. Our other ponies are all missing ears. This one's missing two ears. She's brown and white. My favorite colors. She, Love this is her. Stella pony. Yeah. Oh my gosh, the bird's alive. We have so much stuff up here and there's no room for any of this in our house. We're keeping Birdie though. So, he's Where'd broken. He Do you get rid of things just because they're broken, even if they have value still? My dog! Yeah, Cookie, this is the first time Cookie ever came up here. She's like, woohoo! <laughs> oh guys, my dog follows us everywhere. Yeah, she sure does. All right, let's get to packing. This baby stroller is the best stroller that Sophie's ever had. Like, it is from Pottery Barn and it's a big size. Like, Sophie can even push it now. It's got the adjustable handle. I'm just a little tall. Yeah, she's just a little bit tall for it. But yeah, I, I love it. So we're not getting rid of this, we're giving it to Brooklyn because it's so close to my heart. Comment down below if you know where this horse is from. Where is it from? A subscriber. Oh, that's from a subscriber? Mm -hmm. Put that in the keep pile. This is exhausting. Totally exhausting. I'm doing schoolwork instead of Okay, so, so we made a plan. I found three Shopkins. Yeah, so if he's just looking for toys for herself. <laughs> I'm packing, and Gabby's doing schoolwork because she doesn't want to help with the packing. She will help with the packing though. She packed her whole entire room already, but I give her a choice. Do you guys, do you want to do your, get started on your schoolwork right now or do you want to help with packing? And she said she wanted to help with packing. No, she said she wanted to do her schoolwork. So she's working on mixed After fractions. Play. She's working on fractions. Yes, and this is just the same, just over the top. <sighs> Whoa. Right? Um, Gabby's learning doing a bunch of stuff with fractions. She's working with improper fractions and mixed numbers and a bunch of different things And it's amazing because do you find fractions hard Gabby? No, no, like they're actually really easy. Yeah, like they're so easy if you have time to sit and think about it and learn And if it you... only took me like not even a minute to pick this up mom. Okay. Well this one she's adding um, okay. Fractions with same denominator. So yeah, I told her it's only gonna take you a minute to to uh, pick it up. Yeah. No, only a minute to do the work. Oh, to do the whole page. But yeah, like I it didn't even take a minute to pick it up. Yeah, it's <laughs> super easy. Right. But yeah, it's so super rewarding to be able to like sit here in the attic while I'm cleaning and packing and uh, Gabby can still do her homework. What are you doing to me? <laughs> like why are you smelling me? <laughs> even the dogs are helping it to move. Ruby, you're going to love a farm. Oh, she's I can't gonna wait. love running around there when it's all snowy. She's gonna run around the whole property and eat snow while she's running. Yeah, that's like, what she does. She goes. <sighs> can't see very well in the attic, but anyway, um, yeah, um, it's gonna be so exciting because uh, we already have plans. Like, um, Sam's gonna make a track around the whole perimeter of the property, so, so I could race on it. Yeah, like, there's... I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna turn Storm into a forward horse by racing on that racetrack. First forward horse needs a forward saddle. The poor guy can't move. Like imagine running with your shoulders squished. Like that's what he's doing, right? Well, we don't use our shoulders when we run, unless you feel like this. <laughs> we don't, but they do. I know. But yeah, I know, I hear what you're saying. But yeah, like, um, yeah, so Sam's gonna get that done. He's gonna get like a track around the whole thing because there's no trails there and they need to ride. They need to be able to ride outside and gallop. And the way the property is laid out, it's and like a nice- And all the cars coming by can see me gallop. <laughs> yeah, all the cars. You could imagine one day you go driving down the road and all of a sudden you see Gabby in Storm galloping <laughs> down the side of the road. Yeah, yeah on our property. Like that'd be so cool. It, it, with Ruby right beside me. Yeah. Ruby would. Ruby goes yeah. in between Storm's legs. Yeah, she will not be going between no, Storm's legs while he's running. No, when Storm was at our camping trip, mm -hmm. Ruby used to go underneath the um, fence thingy and go right in between Storm's legs. Yeah, are we, goes, are we going wait. camping again this year? Yes, with Kaylee. Yeah, we're hoping that Kaylee and Tex, we haven't really talked about it with her parents yet, but she's all on board. Um, but yeah, we wanna do that. We wanna, we wanna go to Horse Country Campground again plus, and stay longer and explore more. We have a two plus three horse trailer, so yeah, and Stella goes in the middle or else all her attack would die from Texan Storm. <laughs> yeah, gotta put Stella where she, she does eat stuff now though, get into stuff. It's like, no, because it's like hair bag and she's fat and she wants carrots because she's hungry because she's fat and she needs to lose weight. 
I just want to say one amazing thing is that we're moving really soon and luckily you know, we can still keep all of our stuff in this house. <laughs> not that we want to keep all of our stuff in this house because we need to get it out at some point but like there's we not going to be, the stuff that we need. there's not going to be a huge rush to get out of this house. Like we can move all the stuff we need over there and then keep coming back here and emptying Wonder stuff if we else. need to. But the goal is to get all of it gone by the time we move or soon after when we move. Hey guys, we are headed out to take five a million things to the secondhand store. Our neighbors are probably like, whoa, are they moving? Cause I don't know if you guys know, but neighbors sometimes notice everything that happens. You know, you're a horse mom when you have a horse blanket drying on your, on your porch. Anyways, the hard part of being a horse mom for me is the dirt and the smell. And we're about to get a whole lot dirty and a whole lot dirtier and a whole lot smellier. We're going in my van, but look, Sophie and I are wearing the same coats. Yeah, we got these at Costco. I love hers and her. I got purple and Gabby got blue. And I'm just like, it keeps you warm, but it's so thin. Like I feel weird being out here in the, in the thin, in the cold with a thin coat. Where is Gabby? I thought Gabby was out here. Sophie locked her in the house. No. Anyway, we got packed up and that's not even a quarter of it but it's gonna happen like i got a lot of energy you guys you may what, not notice is this like garbage no it's um secondhand store stuff okay. anyway we are headed out to drop some stuff off guys i'm in my pajamas and i have macy somebody on our channel just suggested in the comments that we do a 24 hour challenge at the barn and we want to do that right um, we can't do it at our barn now, obviously, but when we move, we can do it at our barn. And Kevin's like, yeah, I'll just put a cot, and we have a cot, and storm stall. And I'm like, yeah, till he pees on your head while you're sleeping. No. Or worse, no. poops. yeah, poops on you. Oh my gosh, but it's, we're going to have so much no, fun, you guys. No, he would just, um, he would put it, he would eat my hair. Yeah, he would. He'd be like nudging her, and oh, it was All so right, fun. Me, it's bright in here today. Super bright. Gabby's getting ready. Today's the day to get Stormy Boy moving. We needed a lesson on him. That's why the girls do two lessons a week because we we really need help. Like we need lessons. We do way better with lessons. So I told Fiona this week I want to try and canter on Stella. I just want to try. Okay, he didn't jump yesterday, and the day before he did two little tiny jumps. He did like four. I think he's good. <laughs> One thing is true, Gabby. You do not overwork him. Well, I can when I first got him. Over him. No, he's smelling the horse poop, Gabby. <laughs> I know. Yeah. Right. Okay. Good luck. Jim Canna, people talk about that. Keep those legs nice and still. Yesterday I did this this time. And, um, those rugs. What are we gonna do about his head? He keeps putting it down. All the way, all the way to the ground. That's okay, it's stretching his back. Oh, okay. So it's good, so he's doing it because of his back? Yeah. We're not gonna, don't worry about putting him in frame. Yeah. Ride, pushing him forward. And he can reach, that's good. And reaching for the ground is a good thing. Okay, that's what she said too. Let go till you say so. There isn't anything I wouldn't do. Wanna make sure that you understand. You're the one who gives my life color. There is no one other. With your hand in mine, let me go by your side. Let me go by your side I wanna stay in your sunlight I wanna wake up with you by my side Without you there is no tomorrow We could be in for the best ride Want this to last for the rest of our lives
I am. I'm out to your sides, honey. There you go. And now leg and go. Make him walk. Sometimes you gotta do what your horse needs. When you trot, yes. When you pinch her, you have to light seat. I'm gonna try and keep as much pressure off his back as possible. Look at that happy canter. Keep it, click, click. Good reach for the ground, I love it. Click, click, keep going, keep, click, keep, keep, keep. Look at that bounce. Good boy, keep the reins long, let him keep stretching. That's the trot we wanted right from good. the beginning. And he's licking and chewing now. What a good man. All right, take it to the walk, big breath in. Knees, jump, standard blocks, jump blocks. Our setup for pole bending. What are you doing? No, 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 no. We're gonna do modified pole bending. <laughs> so you're gonna start at this end. You're gonna canter straight down beside the pole, the blocks. And you're gonna break to a trot. You're gonna weave through them all, weave back down them all, and then canter and gallop all the way home. The same thing, right? We're gonna give them a little change of pace on how a little bit of fun. And then we're gonna tuck the hands. And then you're gonna break the trot and then weave up and weave down and then get back to your fast as you can. It's like a race. Just go, and it, the first one will be practice. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. You're right in the top. Doesn't matter. Ready? Set? Go! Get down there! Get, 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 get! Go, 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 go! Yeah! There you go! Breathe out and turn. Yeah, he's like, this is so much fun.
Gabby just said it's really fun. <laughs> Gabby's loving this. Storm's getting some time off of jumping. It's a Christmas present. He's gonna get to rest from jumping. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.